welcome to Do You Know Your History, a show where we're going to go around today and ask people questions to see if they know about their history. We're going to go live today at Charter Oak High School to see if they know their history about the 20th and 21st century. Let's see if Andy is ready. Um, Andy, can, can you hear us? Oh man, I see you guys are there. Oh, I thought you were just showing us how drugs slash drug dealing was such a big thing in the 20th century. Yes, exactly what I was trying to do. Don't do drugs, kids. So, Andy, are you ready to find some lucky people? Yes, I am. Let's go do it right now. While we wait for Andy, let's talk about drugs. Drugs was a main factor of the 20th century. It mostly started in the Vietnam War. Many troops used marijuana on the fields. And back in the United States, hippies experimented using cocaine, marijuana, heroin, and acid. Oh, I am getting word that Andy has found somebody to interview. All right, guys, how's it going? I'm here at Paris. All right, Paris, what was the most important war in the 20th century? The Vietnam War. Did this war impact in a positive or negative matter? Negative matter. Why? Because we sent troops into Vietnam for no reason. We were fighting someone else's war. OK, understandable. Did this event affect the future of the US? Yes, it did. OK, thank you. Now on to the next one. Let's go. Paris is correct. The Vietnam War was such an irritating time for the United States. The war was so irritating because so many people started dying that nobody really wanted to join the war. This started the draft which also made many men flee to Canada to avoid the draft. The war also caused many movements including the... Oh wait, I'm getting word that Andy has found his new person. What's going on guys? I'm back here with our senior class president, Chloe. Alright Chloe. What was the most important movement of the 20th century? Um, I'm gonna have to say the Civil Rights Movement. Yes. Alright, did this movement impact the U.S. in a positive or negative matter? Positive. Why? Um, because it helped end segregation. Segregation, yes. Did, the, did this even affect the future of the U.S.? Yes, it did. Yes, it did. That's it for now. See you guys later. Just like Chloe said, the Civil Rights Movement did end segregation. Movements also had a huge impact on the 20th century. There were movements about minority rights, LGBT rights, native rights, and women rights, and many more. These movements had many impacts to the United States' future. Some may be big, some may be small, but they had a lasting effect on the United States. Oh, I'm getting word that Andy has found another person to interview. What's going Andy? on, guys? I'm Andy, and I'm back at you for Do You Know Your History? Uh, Andy, what happened to your wardrobe? What are you talking about? You seem to have changed your wardrobe. Uh, nope. Same clothes, same happiness, same lifestyle. Alright, well, who do you have for your interview today? Good question. I got Brett, a.k.a. Donald Trump. Alright, Brett. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. How are you, Andy? I'm doing quite damn pretty good. So, who in the 21st century has a big impact on you and the U.S.? Of course, it's Donald Trump. Oh, I wonder why. Why does he have such a big impact to you and the U.S.? Because he's white and he wants to make America great. Make America great, that's right. Yep. How will this person affect the future of the U.S.? He's trying to build a wall. I feel like the wall will really help us. Yes. Keep them beans out. Let's go. On to the next one. Andy, did, did you just say beans? Anyways, Donald Trump will have a huge impact in the United States because of his wall plan and now he wants to keep immig immigrants out of the United States. Oh, okay. I'm getting news now that Andy is live with her one and only Mrs. McKinley. What's going on guys? We're back here in history class with Miss McKinley. All right, Miss McKinley, do you know your history about the 20th century? Because you look old enough to know. What the hell does that mean? Um, huh? Huh? What the? Oh, Who the hell are you? Oh, oh. Andy, Andy, are you okay? Andy, does anyone know what happened to Andy? Can we get the feedback? Can we get the feedback? And Wait, Miss McKinley's not like that! Oh, oh my god! And, and, uh, 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 um, uh, I don't, I don't know what to do. Uh, uh, I have just gotten news that Andy is okay and he will be doing fine. We are actually going to go to him live right now to see how he's doing. 
I'm Andy, and I'm signing off. <laughs> oh, wait, there's more! <laughs> oh, there we go. Really out there. Oh! Shit! Wait, ah! Fuck! Okay, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay, we did. That was perfect. Okay. Oh, fudge. Okay, let's go. Okay.